We have to find a way inside. This can't be right. Reachman in the grotto. Why has her scene allowed this to happen? The grotto belongs to the Glenmoral Weird as a temple to her scene. The Reachman got past our watch and turned our bear guardians against us and destroyed our protective wards. Their leader, Bernark, seeks a Briarheart from her scene. Unless the bear spirits power the wards, we can't enter our own temple. Without the wards, the bears are wild, and we can't reach the altar to ask Hersene why he abandoned us. Can you kill the bears and free their spirits? You must be near an active ward upon the bear's death. The ward will empower you when you are close, so the bear's spirit will sense it and know where to go. Otherwise, the spirit is more likely to simply ascend, to be reunited with the earth. A clan of bears has always safeguarded the grotto. They recognize us as equals and allow us to pass. When we found the Reachmen here, the bears had become hostile. They refused to let us in. Weir Asteria discovered this the hard way. It frees them from enslavement, as their minds are clearly under Brenark's control. The bears know their true purpose. Once the spirit is free, it should travel to the wards and seek to empower it. They serve to protect us as we perform certain rituals to her scene, and without them, we are vulnerable to attacks by the bears. We haven't used them in quite some time, but an important ceremonial hour approaches, and we need to perform our rites. Yes, if ever a threat came to us, we would come here, empower them through sacrifice, and be protected. Luckily, the Reachmen only see them as rocks. No, if they were, it would have required a great many sacrifices to maintain. The Briarheart is a powerful gift, which makes an almost invincible foe, and we suspect Bernark's target would be Evermore, which makes this an issue for your kind to address. The Reachmen conquered the city before, and will want it back. Your journey is dangerous. Be wary of the Guardians. They guard the temple fiercely with their lives. I take comfort in knowing their death is for a good cause. Curse these Reachmen! They've been a thorn in our side for too long. I should have seen them coming. One of us is always here to care for the temple. We trust the bears to guard it well, but they can't maintain it. I was the caretaker of the grotto when the Reachmen arrived. I, I should have seen them coming to get word out sooner. The wards are back, and the bears are no longer hostile to us. Now we'll call upon Hercene, and find out why he's forsaken us. As you restored the wards, you are now a part of the grotto's life too. Therefore, I will ask you to perform a necessary role in our sacrifice. 
We need a still beating heart. You've offered to assist us? I asked you to be the ultimate sacrifice to save the grotto. You are the key to reaching her scene. No! My rights, I should be the one to take the blade. I'm the one who failed. Naironi, no! This person has already offered to help us. The sacrifice should come from the weird. And I'm the one responsible. Lene, she's right. The heart of a stranger compared to a self-sacrifice? Her scene is bound to hear an answer. But we need three for the ritual. She can't do it. The outsider can do it. Only two of us are required for the prayers. I won't allow it. You've no choice. Do you want this to succeed or fail? Nironi is ready and willing. You know we're right. As much as I hate to admit it, Tyria is right. Nironi's willing sacrifice is priceless compared to yours. I raised her, you know. We found her abandoned. A lost child that the wood kept safe until we discovered her. Much more than that. We're tied through both a familial bond and the forest itself. We may seem callous to outsiders, but we're closely knit. What we ask of you is not to be taken lightly. This is a serious and sensitive matter. Understood? I hope so. Take this ceremonial dagger. It's well sharpened to ensure swift work. Tyria and I will perform the ritual. Once prepared, you must act quickly to cut out the heart of Nironi and place it on the altar. Not after falling so far out of Hercene's favor. Believe me, if there were another way, a way to spare Nironi's life, I'd do it. Now, will you honor her decision and help us? Weirus Nironi's sacrifice should be the extra edge we need to call upon her scene. Yes, Nironi is... prepared. I can't say it will be easy. At least, for me. This is the way of the Glenmoral Weird. Everything makes sacrifices. The plants and beasts that we may eat. The wood that we may have fire. The people we've come to love. There's nothing wrong with sacrifice. So long as it's done properly. Good. Wait for my signal. When the time is right, cut out her heart and place it on the altar. We're ready. Now cut out her heart! Put her heart in the bowl on the altar. What is it My you prince, seek? We seek to know why. Silence, pray. I speak not to the weak, but to the one who took the heart. This one interests me. Come, speak to me, hunter. You are not mere prey, mortal. Yet you aid the weird who still lick their wounds of defeat. Their fall to Brannock and his reachmen lost them my favor. To earn it back. You must prove yourself a true hunter. To start, a hunter's challenge of skill. Hunt my aspects within my hunting grounds, a shade of this realm and my own. Prove yourself worthy of my favor. Only then will you earn the chance to retake the grotto for the weird. I will place you there. When you've won, if you've won, return to the shrine. I will be there as the spirit of the hunt. We'll discuss your prowess and your final task for the grotto when the hunt is over. I'm not sure how much time I have, but thank you for what you've done. My sacrifice is nothing compared to your brave response to Hercene's challenge. Can I help you understand this realm, a place of shadow, hunger, and thirst? Strength, speed, and guile. I know them well. He sent you to track them. The Hunter's Test, which I once undertook myself. Though I've not been dead for very long, I will answer your questions as a final favor. The aspect of strength takes the form of a bear. Crouch low to the ground to search for signs of its passing.
a creature so large doesn't leave a subtle trail. The aspect of speed takes the wolf form. You may surprise it within its den, but only if you are careful. Look for its paw prints, which may appear as stars on the ground in this realm. The aspect of Guile is the hunter. He'll be the hardest to track, for he wants no prey to realize his nearness. But every hunter must rest sometime. Seek his camp, and if you are lucky, the hunter will be there. Good luck, hunter. It's time for me to pass on and rejoin the cycle. specimen for my collection. Two hunters and one grotto. To the victor goes the spoils. Find Brannock and rip the briar heart from his chest. Prove yourself the true hunter, and he the prey. And the grotto is yours. Should you prove yourself the victor, bring the Reachman's fledgling briar heart back to the altar. I will speak to you one last time, if you succeed. A final challenge for us both. This should be easy. Doubtful. I defeated the weird. I'll defeat you just as easily. The power of the Briarheart will be mine permanently. Soon, I'll retake Evermore and all the land which once belonged to my people. Your kind will be stamped out, and I will rule all! That's what you think. Come and get me. The Briarheart, this Grotto Evermore, and all these petty kingdoms will be mine. What happened? Has Hercene asked something of you? You've proven yourself a true hunter. And Brynark? What of him? Only one Supreme Hunter would be left. And with Bernark defeated, we can take back the Grotto. Go, and luck be on your side. We'd assist, but it would be forbidden. So, you're to kill Bernark? Good. Tamriel will be better for it.
after this. I'll take your heart as a prize. Your victory will be remembered. We could feel the death of Bernark through the earth beneath our feet. Even the insects will not mourn him. Thank you for making our sister's death worth it. We're in your debt. We still have a lot of work to do. Cleaning out the remaining Reachmen and regaining the full trust of the Bears. We can feel the connection returning, but there's no telling what damage has already been done, and how long it will take to undo. Now please, return the Briarheart to Hercene. Proven hunter, I see you have the Briar Heart, torn from the chest of the Reachman. His punishment for failure is to roam the hunting grounds as prey. His chest, a gaping hollow, a reminder of his weakness. Consider it returned. The grotto belongs to the weird once again, but more importantly, to you. I'll be watching you, mortal. A larger hunt looms in your future, one I'll watch with great interest. Thanks for all you've done. We have work to do, but with the threat of a Briarheart removed, the rest will be easier. Would you rather I gnash my teeth and fall to the ground weeping? Some grief is too deep to show itself. I see her body before me, and though I will miss her very much, my life will go on. Naironi is the daughter of my heart, and my sister in the Glenmoral Weird. Though she breathes her last, she will always be with us. But your journey should go on. Be at peace in your own heart. You did the right thing to help us. <laughs>